So I get asked all the time, if I was to choose a handful of baits for all the different fishing conditions, what would they be? And man, that is a really tough question because there's so many different baits out there that I use and, uh, and they're all great under certain conditions. But if I was to choose just five, it would have to be these five right here. A chatterbait, a casting jig, a Texas rig worm, a Ned rig, and a hall body frog. I'll throw that one in for kicks, that one's a lot of fun. But essentially what I'm looking for is, is something, is baits to cover all the water column and also for, for different moods of fish. So the chatterbait was my choice for the uh, reaction bait. You can move it really fast, you can cover a lot of water, it has a lot of action, it works well in clear water all the way to muddy water, and it's just a really good big fish bait and it catches a lot of fish for me, so uh, I had to throw that one in there. The casting jig, again, is a very versatile bait. You can fish it on the bottom, you can cast it underneath docks, you can skip it really easily, um, you can flip it into brush, into vegetation. You can use it in a lot of different situations, and you can also use it as a reaction bait by swimming it. So it's a really versatile bait, and, uh, and that one had to be in there just because uh, of the versatility factor. The Texas rig worm, that's kind of a staple. Everybody loves fishing a Texas rig. Um, that, uh, that one you can fish on the, on the bottom for active and inactive fish. Um, it, it, you can choose a variety of different size weights and different size worms and, uh, and cover all different types of depth zones and, uh, and fish activity levels. And then I ended up adding the Ned Rig in there for the finesse style of fishing. When I'm faced with really highly pressured, highly inactive, clear water fish, the Ned Rig works extremely well because the, those fish just can't help but biting it. Just so small, they're not scared of it, um, and and they just they just eat that thing up. I love that in clear water. Hey, the frog, uh, I had to add that one in there. There's nothing more exciting than a bass exploding on a frog on on top water, and it goes really well through cover. So you can fish it around all types of cover that these baits won't be able to go through, and uh, it's just really exciting bait to th to fish. So those are my five. Uh, favorite baits to be able to cover all different types of conditions.